election winner is Ruby V. Muniz. After it was announced that Muniz won the election, a screenshot of a message she sent to a student was posted in a popular Fresno State student Facebook group. Many students commented and expressed their concerns about the outcome of the election. Members must not engage in conduct that involves dishonesty, intentional deception, misrepresentation, or unlawful discrimination. The student court ruled that Muniz violated the ASI Code of Ethics when she promised gift cards in exchange for proof of votes in her favor. This is one of those instances where the student's voice, we listened to what the students wanted, and that's what ASI is here for. If it hadn't been posted on the Facebook book and trade advice, I think that uh, ASI and a lot of students might have overlooked it, but I am glad that it was able to gain that traction. ASI held a special Senate meeting where Muniz was able to express her feelings about the process. This process has been handled wrong, and I personally have been treated unfairly, and the decisions due to this process are actionable by blank failure of leadership and process of this organization. I was elected as the President of State's ASI president elect, and if today you all determine that my incentive is actionable, if you overturn the student's election or deny me the right to run again, you will deny Fresno State students and myself our constitutional due process. Muniz was not allowed to participate in the re-election. Nalia Estrada and Elizabeth Rocha Zuniga were the only two candidates on the ballot.